Welcome to SEO DT, your all-in-one SEO and AI-driven content creation tool. In this video, we will walk you through the key features of SEO DT and show you how to get started on your journey to SEO success. Let's start by adding new project. Type domain here. Click next step. And you can uh, fill your keywords by clicking this button and magic it happen. Okay, click start analysis. And that's it. You're in SEO DT. This is the domain overview module and you can check any domain here. So for example, like check this one and click enter or click start analysis button and here is the domain rank of the domain and here you can uh, check uh, organic keywords count uh, estimated organic traffic paid traffic backlinks number uh, referring domains count and here you can see organic shares overview per country top keywords per country and here you can connect your Google Analytics and Google Search Console. And this is the organic traffic module. And you can see keywords that refer to the domain. And of course you can change the domain here and click search keyword. So you can change, you can research any domain, any composer you want. Well, let's go to the SEO DT again. Okay, and here you can see the rank of each keyword, the change, uh, the URL intent, estimated organic traffic, keyword difficulty, search volume, and Google Ads competition, uh, CPC, also for Google Ads. To filter, those keywords. If you want to research, for example, for long tail keywords, you can do that here. Just select the column you want to filter. And for example, you can do something like this one. Okay, so uh, we will see the keywords with the count of the words greater than five. You can also save those filters save as preset and then you can use those presets uh, in any project you want. You can also use our uh, predefined filters so you can easily uh, check the keywords with great potential. You can also change those parameters here and click apply. Okay, let's clear those uh, filters and uh, we will compare this domain with the competition but sometimes you don't know who uh, are your competitors so SEO DT will suggest you the competitors based on the similarity uh, we check uh, keywords uh, and we check the similarity of the keywords with uh, competitors and just click here this plus button to add those competitors and click save changes okay so now you we can use it uh, so select the competitor you want and here we can choose the method of the analysis uh, for example this is the keyword gap so uh, this is the method that we will show the keywords that your computer uh, have but you don't uh, so you can also use keyword intersection to check which keywords you have and your computers uh, as well and again you can like before uh, use any filters and use presets here and 
to add those keywords to the rank tracker and track uh, those keywords daily, just select them here and click Add to Rank Tracker. Uh, you can choose the country, uh, you can choose uh, region if you want to uh, precisely locate and choose language, device, you can choose desktop and mobile. Uh, you can also select the category and if you want to select all, uh, check, uh, change all of those keywords, just click full keyword edit. And now add keywords and that's it. Those keywords are uh, added to the uh, rank tracker. And this is the rank tracker module. So you, like you can see those key, those added keywords are here and those uh, keywords uh, which we added at the uh, beginning uh, are here. And we're still waiting for the data CPC and competition and search volume. Uh, it could take uh, maximum 30 minutes. And the great thing uh, in the rank tracker is that you can see the self features so you can check the people also ask here and by clicking it is covered so you can use those data uh, later for example if you want to add them to note or to task just click here and paste it This is the great thing if you are doing some research. And you can assign a team member and you can choose the end date, the deadline here. Uh, you can also select some keywords you are researching and add to the resources so uh, those keywords will be in the uh, task or no and you can back uh, later to them. And this is the Calendar Explorer module and you can check here uh, which web pages have the biggest traffic or the uh, organic traffic, or, or sorry, organic keywords count uh, or page traffic. And also, like before, you can uh, research any domain here just type it or you can choose from competitors and to check the keywords that refers to the uh, specific uh, web page uh, you can do that just here and show traffic and there's the uh, pop-up window and to be more detailed you can check in the organic traffic uh, module so as you can see this is the web page and you can check which uh, keywords they have and of course you can change the uh, country and language here and let's check the keyword research now so type the keyword here and click search keyword or just click enter and like you can see you can select some keywords from here and you can also filter them check maybe monthly keywords again okay let's find them yeah there's a lot of monthly keywords that we can uh, use for our content but we can also check uh, another uh, method of query here and we can check questions for each keyword so we will know uh, what queries uh, so what questions our user asked and we can answer for them in the our article for example or on the our landing page okay now let's see the backlinks module and again 
Like before, you can select the competitor here or you can type any domain just here. But uh, what I want to show you, it's sometimes like it is hard to see uh, great backlinks, especially for your computer, it's really hard to uh, know what strategy they have. But we have presets here and we can check only the good ones. So just one click and you will get all of the backlinks your computer have, but the good ones. And you can check anchors, referring domains uh, in this module. Also, you can export like everywhere uh, in CSV and PDF. Okay, this is the reports module and let's add the new report. Just click add report and here you can choose the template. You can also create your own template. So uh, you will make this report uh, based on your components. And of course, you can, it is the weight label report. So you can change uh, logo here and anything else. So let's choose the maybe the prospecting template. I'll click next and you can generate PDF from this, this one. Uh, it is based on the projects we had and also you can send by email. So you can schedule time for sending this email and you can carry uh, on your current customers uh, or you can uh, prospect the new one uh, automatically. So maybe I have this. So we can schedule the frequency of this, those uh, reports here. We can choose weekly, daily, monthly. Uh, for weekly, we can choose the day and the hour and just safe report. So this report will be sending uh, at 12 a.m. Uh, on Monday. And you can see the status here and you can also see the logs here. You can check this report, uh, you can download. And if you want to send uh, this PDF manually, you can also do that. And this is the AI content editor. Uh, the great thing about this content editor, it is the, we generate content based on our SEO data. Uh, and it is based on GPT-4. Uh, so to do that, you can go, for example, for uh, Content Explorer and let's check our competitors and maybe search by uh, organic traffic and just, okay, this article will be pretty good. And just click generate article and generate text here. And our calendar is started generating. So you can see uh, it is, this article is based on the article we click and our content uh, editor will generate the whole article based on our SEO data. So it is really, really accurate. Uh, you can also change, maybe stop generating for now, uh, you can also change the method of generating here. So you can uh, generate article based on the keywords. And to do that, just uh, select some keywords uh, like before. So just maybe this one and this one and click generate article. And those keywords are added there. And again, you can click generate text. And if you want to generate uh, frequently asked questions, uh, you can do that by URL, but also you can check 
uh, people also ask from rank tracker for example and you can just paste here those keywords and those uh, frequency ask questions will be generated automatically uh, you can also uh, make audit of your content using this one so just click uh, on the context folder and maybe we can do that here generate article but change the method here and uh, we will make audit of our uh, existing uh, content uh, based on the real text and based on the real data we provide to the uh, GPT-4. I think you will love it. And it is that's, that's it. And if you have any questions, just let me know by chat or via email. Uh, we are here for you. Thank you so much. Bye-bye.